What's up guys, my name is Wild Leprechauns, and today I'm bringing you a gameplay commentary. I uh, really don't have a topic, but uh, hopefully something interesting comes out of it. So, uh, this is a gameplay, first I'll talk about gameplay quickly. It's a gameplay where I use the MP7 with long barrel and fast mags, I think. And I really like that combination with a lot of SMGs. The long barrel, although it doesn't really boost the uh, effective range that much, it, it does it enough for me to want to use the attachment. I think it's like 20% or something, but it, but it's definitely worth using if you uh, use something like the MP7 or um, Vector and they have a little bit lower range than some of the other SMGs and it could really push it to just where it's almost better than some of the others. Like, I personally enjoy using the Vector or the MP7 because it's... They don't really have that much recoil and they have a really high fire rate, which is a nice combination and they do a pretty decent amount of damage. So I use it with the long barrel, makes it do a little bit more damage over that range and... Yeah, it just increases its effect in so well. well. That's enough about the gameplay. Uh, I think today I'm going to talk a little bit about the, the shootings and the whole topic of gun control in the United States. And this is a 15 year old's perspective, soon to be 16, on the whole subject matter. Beca and uh, yeah, so it might seem like I'm an idiot, but that's just because I'm younger than a lot of like f philosophical people and stuff, so yeah. My personal opinion, I think gun control in the United States should be a little bit more strict, but honestly, I think that if an evil human being is going to do something, they will do it no matter what. Even if you take away their guns, they're going to find a way to get the gun, or find a way to do it with something else. Like, you take away the guns, they're going to go to explosives, or knives, or something of this sort, and they'll do what they want. If people are evil, that's what my conclusion is from all the uh, shootings and stuff that have happened. People are just... Inside of them, some people are just terribly evil, and they just, their hearts are like black, they don't have feelings or care, and sometimes it's their mental condition, but overall, people are just, some of them are just messed up, and that's just my per per bleh, point of view on the whole subject matter. Like, gun control, I think that some weapons, like assault rifles, they're not exactly needed, and especially like the 100 round magazines and stuff. In real life, you don't need that if you're going hunting for a deer. You don't need like an AK-47 that has a 100 round magazine or something like that to go hunting deer. You really just need like a rifle or something. Although I know, don't go hunting, so I don't know what kind of hunting you would need that for. Maybe some people need like an AK-47 to go hunting bears or something, but I don't know. That'd be interesting and kind of easy. See a bear shoot with like, five, like 50 shots dead. But, uh, yeah. Oh, look, right there, you see that, uh, little 36, that's pretty cool. But anyway, um, what else can I talk about? Besides gun control, there's not really much to talk about. I'll just go into a little bit about my life. So I'm a 15-year-old, live in New York, and, uh, I'm a sophomore for all you people in the United States, or 10th grade for anybody out of the United States. And, uh, I have midterms next week, which is gonna suck. So I might have to make less videos next week, hopefully not, because I do have a few days off. And uh, hopefully I can put out a lot of videos. Like, past two weeks I've been trying to put a video out every single day, which I've uh, kept to, which is pretty good. I'm definitely getting back on schedule, because I, I record with my laptop for Black Ops 2 and everything, and then my desktop computer, because it's kind of out of the way, can't really plug it into my capture card, so I have to use a transfer cable. And I didn't know you could use an Ethernet cable at the time, so I just set up a network between the computers just the other day, so I could transfer stuff wirelessly. But that did not work well because I was getting gigabyte files transferring at like 15 minutes per gigabyte, and it was terrible. So I just decided, oh, let's see if I can put an Ethernet in, and bingo, it worked. So I should be able to upload Black Ops 2 more often. That's the main reason I kind of shifted over to Minecraft and uh, other PC games more than Black Ops 2, which was my origins and stuff. But anyway guys, um, next thing we're gonna talk about. More games and stuff are coming to my channel, that's that's one thing I want to say. I, uh, I recently just put up The Binding of Isaac, which was uh, pretty fun to record. A lot of people don't know how to record that game, so I could just explain it quickly here. You, um, you just have to use a screen recording program like Bandicam, or pretty much any other screen recorder, like Fraps, whatever. And you just record your whole screen and make sure that you're outputting it as like 720p. And then you just use like an editing program, like I use Sony Vegas and stuff. And you just have to cut it so only the actual window is part of like the uh, video that you're seeing. 
and then you just have to like use a I don't know in so other programs I don't know how to do this but in Sony Vegas you can make stuff widescreen so uh, yeah that's pretty much it there's more games and stuff to come this commentary was entirely random hope you enjoyed it next time I'll probably have a more organized commentary and uh, yeah check out my new outro if you guys like it just leave some comments ratings and stuff I'm making it a lot easier for you to subscribe and view other videos on my channel and stuff so I'm done guys bye